Brady, uh, could you walk us through your two uh, RBI hits, the, the RBI single and also the home run? What did you see on those? And uh, how big was it, you think, to get those both the two outs? Yeah, um, the first at bat, the single, um, the, uh, the pitcher left the slider up, uh, put a good swing on it, got it through the hole. I know early on, a lot of guys were hitting it hard right at people, not finding the hole, so I'm glad that got through. And then, uh, you know, not missing a fastball um, when they give you one on the home run. Bob? Yeah, Brady, when you have a game like this early in your time here at Arkansas, especially against a team like Texas, how, how big is that? What, what does that do for your confidence or just your, your overall feeling about being on this level? Yeah, it's big. Um, you know, you get, in a, you get in a groove. You know, baseball is all about being comfortable and uh, being in a groove. And, you know, it definitely helps. You know, definitely a good mind booster. Matt? What's the transition been like from junior college? Has it been a, a big transition for you? Um, it's, it's a lot. I mean, it's a lot more difficult here. Um, you know, you really get used to it. Um, and if you don't, you know, you get left behind. And so you really have to, you know, learn how to hit against these SEC type of arms. And, uh, you know, everybody's good that you're going to face. So you got to learn and you got to learn quickly. Nate? Yeah, just kind of what was your mindset when you learned that, that Goodhart wasn't be, going to be able to make the trip and you'd be DHing? Um, you know, I love Goodhart. I mean, he was supposed to be my roommate here. Um, you know, he's kind of, ever since I got here, he's took me under his wing. Um, you know, he's been the guy that's been there for me. And so, you know, it was tough seeing um, that he wasn't be able to come. Um, but, you know, I hope he gets back soon and, you know, better. Tom? Yeah, I want to ask you about the pitching you saw tonight. 15 strikeouts from your guys and uh, Bolden really, really holding them down at the end. Oh, yeah. Our was great tonight. You know, I think that shows really what our pitching staff is capable of. Um, you know, Paulette threw amazing. Um, Monk threw amazing. Um, and then Bolden at the end was unbelievable. He's been good, you know, ever since I got here. So that's not really a surprise to me. All right, let me know if you've got more in the chat. Hutch? I was going to ask you specifically about uh, Peyton. Uh, have you had to face him at all in the, in the fall or preseason? What, what's it like going up against them? Oh, yeah, I've, I've faced him quite a bit. Um, you know, he throws hard. Um, you know, in the, in the fall, he would go, you know, one or two innings. So his, his velocity's up. Um, not down and, you know, he's got a really good breaking ball and he's uh, developed a change up, you know, as of late. So he's not, he's not fun to hit against and he's a really good pitcher. Bob. I'm, I'm actually good. <laughs> Matt. Hey, Brady, what have, what have the atmosphere has been like down there on, on the television? It almost feels like a bowl game type feel. It's been crazy. You know, I've never seen anything like it. Um, you know, I've never been to Omaha, but I'm, ass I'm assuming this is kind of like what Omaha feels, you know, playing in front of, you know, 15,000, probably, I think it's probably more too, you know, big lights are on. It's, it's awesome. I can't, you just can't describe the feeling.